I'm about to experience what a 28-hour ferry looks like here in Peru. It's from the city of Pucallpa all the way up to the city of Iquitos on the Amazon River. I don't know what to expect. All I know is it costs $100 and that it's 28 hours long. So safe to say, I think it's going to be brutal. But either way, let's do it. Welcome to Peru. <laughs> Americano, England, England, England. Si, good. Si, muy bien. Oh, this is like local alcohol. Whiskey. Whiskey. Really? It's good. Bien. Let me smell it. Woo! That is strong. It's 8 a.m. He's got some whiskey. <laughs> Gracias. First things first, we need some liquids for this journey. Hola. Uh, dos? Dos? Tres. Si, tres. And aqua? Uh, tres. Si. Si. Right, I've got me in bold four Gatorade each, four bottles of water each. So hopefully that's enough to get us through this 28 hour journey. But let's find out. Hola, ¿cómo estás? May I've got us, um, Mr. Bold. Oh, what have you got, mate? Just Gatorade, waters. Oh, oh, man, you filled us up. But I couldn't find any food. <laughs> okay, we'll just have Gatorade. <laughs> <laughs> Nice one, Does the boat stop at all in this time? We have no idea. I've been speaking to this lady, okay. and she said no stopping, 28 hours down to Iquitos. And she said 28 hours, that is if there's no problems. There's definitely going to be problems. So this is the waiting room, ready for departure. We've got an hour waiting in this, like, basically giant shed. And, um, yeah, hopefully we're going to be setting off in about an hour. Wow, so this is life by the river. People making their money. A lot of people drinking here as well. It's very early. It's like 9 a.m. or something. Everyone's wasted around here. My type of people. Just having a laugh, having a drink here in Peru. Hola. Okay. Well, let's have a little walk around. I have no idea which boat I'm going to be taking. Surely it's not going to be one of these like small wooden ones for 28 hours. But you never know here in Peru. Probably is. Wait a minute. Hold on a minute. Kayore. One second. Kayore. That's that blue boat right there. So that might be the one going to Iquitos. Let's go look at it. Hola, Iquitos. Yes, Iquitos? Yes, yes. Wow. Ah, it's good. I like it. Can I come and look? See? Si? Si. Gracias. Okay, okay. Gracias. Wow, here we go. Oh, it's a party boat. It's music playing. Wow. So this is it. The boat I'm going to be on for 28 hours. There's TVs on here. Fans. Life vests. Wow, I like it. The only negative is nowhere to lie down, but there is two hammocks here. I don't know who's going to be sitting there. No idea. There's the engines, spare equipment. Wow, I like it. It's good. Gracias. I'll see you soon. Gracias. Gracias. Okay. Oh, well, there you go. That is the boat I'm going to be taking to Iquitos. I like it. The only negative, you can't lie down, so it's going to be exhausting come the end of it, but whatever. Should be alright, it's a good laugh. And uh, yeah, there's TV to watch some music. Anyway, we're going to chill out now, and uh, yeah, very soon we're going to be getting on that boat. So I'll see you then. Well, here we go. Who's ready to witness me? on a 28-hour ferry through the Amazon to Iquitos. Now time has come. It's time to get on the boat. Here we go.
Okay. Amigo? Tickets? Tickets? See? Well, at least they're playing a bit of Spanish music this time. Here we are. Amigo? Trezo. Okay, thank you. Gracias. My um, God. <laughs> welcome on board the party ship. Cheers, what mate. The Isle of the Window. <laughs> and this is it. Our two seats for the next 28 hours. You excited, mate? Um, I'm feeling trepidation. Trepidation? Trepidation. What does that mean? It means like excitement and nerves together. Apprehensive? Worry. That also. Yeah. I'll ask him again in 20 minutes when we set off. Oh. But this is it, this is the boat. Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's awful. There's no room. There's no room at all. But all right, it's all right, isn't it? Oh, I've got a bet that Mr. Bowl can't hack it. He's going to get off at the next town in about 12 hours' time. <laughs> I'm staying strong. I'm doing the full 28 hours to the off. Big claim, mate, big claim. That will be my longest ever journey. It beats my 27 hours on a Tanzanian train. It beats my 24 hours on Indian buses. This is number one. Mr. Bold is buying random shit off these sellers on oh, the boat. Why would you say that hot cross buns are random? <laughs> what about green circle in a bit? toaster. <laughs> what about this? What's this lady selling? I don't know, but I'm not buying it. Uh, my amigo. Amigo. It's an ice cream. But let's buy two. Dos, 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 dos. Gracias. Gracias, Miren. What is it? Yeah, it's a popsicle. Well, wait there, wait there. Let me record you filming this one. This is going to be yeah, so yeah, funny. Yeah, yeah. Let me try uh, open this slug and take The weakest man on YouTube. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's wrong with this guy? What? Try it. Try no, I'm not trying it. Try it. I'm not Please. trying it. Try it. I'm not trying nothing, mate. I'm not trying. I'll pay for the next hotel. You've just bloody no. <laughs> Please. No, I've got my own one. I'm saving it. Oh my god. No, Mirena, your company. Gracias. It company. tastes like durian. If you know what durian is, that's what it tastes like. Oh my god. <laughs> Like this. Yeah, it's lovely. I love it, mate. Don't worry about that. See, the difference between me and Backpacker Ben, Backpacker Ben subscribers, is that when I go to a country, I try the local comida, as they say. Of course you do. Oh. <laughs> Fuck, it's cold. <laughs> it's safe to say I don't like them. Yes, not the best things. There we go. We still haven't left. We've been on this boat well over an hour. He told us to be here at 11 a.m. sharp. And we were, we heard like 10 a.m. Why haven't we left yet? I don't know. The boat's really full up now, so um, hopefully we'll leave in any minute now. Well, we still haven't left. It's coming up to 1 p.m. It's sat in this boat for two hours. And I need to go to the toilet. So it's time to investigate what the toilets look like here on the boat. Here we go. Okay, there's one. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Oh, Jesus. It's 1 p.m. We have finally left port. Only two hours delayed. Next stop, Iquitos. Let's do it. Excited, mate? Wow, Breaking look, the it. Amazon River. Lovely, lovely brown colour. <laughs> <laughs> Can you hear me? Good. Yeah. I guess that 
life here. I've got my passport, my camera, my wallet, my camp, everything. Jesus. But this is it, this is the Amazon. We are two hours into the journey, and this is what we've been looking at, deep into the Amazon. Look at this. Now we keep coming across these random locos on these boats. So remote out here. Four hours down, 24 to go. It's good fun though, isn't it, mate? Hey, I'm having a great time, I've got to be honest. So far, it's been very enjoyable. I Beautiful agree. Countryside. We were dreading this, but so far, loving it. So on my map, we were literally in the middle of nowhere. I'm talking 150 kilometers from Pukapa. The next city is a place called Copamana or something. That's where people get off and more people get on. So that's probably gonna be my last chance to get a meal in me. We brought no food. All we brought us a few power aids and some water, but no food. Apart from those hot cross buns that Mr. Bold bought. Oh. Yeah. But I need like a proper meal. So hopefully when it stops in the next village, people come on with like rice or something. chickens in a cage up there. Stuck in this cage for 28 hours. Poor buggers. Where's my seat? Where's my seat? I've come back to my seat and Mr. Bowl has been replaced. Hola. <laughs> Take this. Careful. <laughs> Alright, so far so good guys. We're five hours in. 23 to go. But yeah, can't follow so far. I'm enjoying it. So let me show you where we are, guys. This is where we started in the city of Bukapa. We've come up the river for five hours and we are only just here. We've still got all of this to go all the way up, this is the next place, Kotama, and then our next place is Ekitos, which is where? Up here, this is the size of Peru, massive. Sorry mate, you've been replaced. <laughs> what is this young dude in my chair? I don't know, go find somewhere else to sit. I'll have to. How <laughs> We are in the middle of nowhere, like miles and miles away from the cities, and we've come across this village. Look at this. In the middle of nowhere. There's people in the distance on a swing or a bench. Wow, what a place. Banana. Banana? <laughs> you have a uh, fish like this? Same? No? Finish. Well, this is perhaps the most remote place I've ever been on my travels. In some random village here in the Amazon. With people cooking bananas, chickens and dogs. Not cooking chickens and dogs, but cooking bananas. Wow. Conta Costa. Uh, One. See, si, okay. One dollar. I need to... One dollar. One dollar. Yes. Not too sure what's happening. Just gave that man 20. I think he's going to give me a banana or some fish. I'm not too sure. I gave him 20, but I don't know what it's getting us. Here we go. It is a banana that I'm getting. Dos banana, por favor. Whoa. I think she's going to chop it up. Si, si, gracias. Mr. Bowl, two bananas on its way with butter. Oh, that's good. Banana. Wow, see. Asado. Mantequilla. Okay. Right. Got me two bananas. Let's get back on a boat and continue this journey. 
Only about 19 hours to go. Oh, whoa! Let's see how. Gracias. Well, it's time to try an Amazonian banana. It's very hot, by the way. Fresh off the fire. Oh. Mm. Good, mate. We're stopping off in some random town here. Seven hours later, sun's just gone down. Loads of locals are now going to get off. Loads of locals are going to get back on. But me and Mold are just halfway through the trip. We've still got another, what is it, 20 hours left? But yeah, look at this. Random little town. Well, here we go. Welcome to the city of Contamana. It says in the distance there, underneath the mermaid. This is going to be our final stop of the evening. And then it's all systems go non-stop all the way to Iquitos. Here's all the people getting off. And here's all the people getting on. Judging by the boat, there's not many people staying on for Iquitos. So I think it's going to be me and Mr. Bold and a few others doing a dreaded journey. But so far I've enjoyed it. I've actually loved it to be fair. When you're on top of this deck through the Amazon, it's good fun. When you're back there, where the seats are, it's brutal. So it's definitely gonna be a brutal night sleeping in that seat. But yeah, so far, so good. Jungle juice, beer of the jungle. Okay. Bien. Jesus Christ. Bien. Yes. Maybe yes. jump, mate. Oh. <laughs> Adios. Hey, de donde eres? Uh, de Francia. No, Inglaterra. Inglaterra. Get this shit. Me that guy. Is, uh, hell. Si, yo, yeah. no, yo no sé francés. Ah, uh, yes. Solo inglés, inglés uh, un poquito español. Before that man scared the shit out of me, <laughs> I was going to ask you a question. Ask me. What's your thoughts on the boat so far? Bear in mind, it's 20 hours to go. So far? Well, so far, there's been things to look at. Correct. So it's been kind of interesting. Oh, jungle for the first time, never seen the Amazon. But I'm thinking now, as it gets dark, nothing to look at <laughs> out the window. Just like 12 hours of total darkness. The hot, hot humid. Hola. 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 I agree. I know what you're trying to say. Uh, I'm gonna have a couple of these, couple of these beers and then continue the journey through the nights. Cheers. <laughs> Safe to say, me and Bold will not be sleeping tonight. There's a local looking at me now in a pissed off way, saying turn that light off. Ain't gonna happen, mate. It's gonna be a long night. Got a Jason Staper movie on. There he is, the man, the legend. was your idea. 14 hours down, 14 to go. We are officially halfway. Good morning. Hey, good. Sleep well? No, but I've fun. Listen to couples. Enjoy. Listen to the chickens waking us up. Whatever the hell it is. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Well, it's the next morning here in the Amazon, in some very remote village. We've just stopped 
safe to say I had zero sleep last night. Mr. Bold had about probably six hours, so he's well rested. What a brutal night that was. Anyway, yeah, we're stopping in some random village, a place where tourists never go. And we are letting more people on, and more people are getting off. We're about eight hours from Iquitos, so yeah. Another long day ahead of us, but let's hope for the best. Right, let's get back on the boat before it goes without me. Well, here we go again. Through the Amazon. Oh, look, it's Mr. Bold. Mate, you look well rested. Okay. Well rested. Well, basically, you had about eight hours sleep last night and I had about two minutes. That's not true. It is true. Sit down, have to take your seat. Oh, man. I thought it was completely full again. There was a bit of space before, but now there's nothing. Anyway, eight hours to go. Or nine or ten, who knows? I have no idea. Right, just to update you on where we are on the map. We are here on this blue arrow. We're coming up to a little town called Uranus. So we're heading up Uranus. And then we go up the river, further, to a place called Requena, which looks like a big town. So maybe I can get out and have a little mince around there. And then it's the long river to Iquitos, which should be here. Yep, there it is. So we've got a long journey ahead of us. Well, we are 29 hours into the journey. We're supposed to be in Iquitos right now. Mr. Bowles just went and spoke to the captain. Mate, what's happened? Well, we're about five hours more from Iquitos. <laughs> We've just hit the Amazon River. Um, so he said, we're going to stop off at a port. And from that port, there's a road to Iquitos and it takes one to a half hours in a taxi. I don't know if that's true or not. So I don't trust anything Captain says. But, um, <laughs> so we've got a choice. Four hours ago, he said to us, we'll be in Iquitos in four hours. Now he's saying it's going to be five hours from where we are now. So you better get off in the next town and get a taxi. I mean, I think that's what we're going to do. Why would the road be quicker than the boat? I don't know. And it looks like on the map it's the same. I think we're getting scammed again. Are we getting like, is this some part of taxi scam? <laughs> again. <laughs> this is the scammiest country. Where's <laughs> India? <laughs> Los viajes en la ciudad de Quito, por favor, se van a dirigir a la empresa de transportes. 50, 50, 50. Gracias, mister. Gracias, amigo. Gracias. Adiós. Adiós. Oh, no. Oh, señor. Nice. Well, who is this man? Hello. Hello. Okay. That's our taxi driver. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. Hello. 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 Now let's get a taxi to Iquitos. 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 Yes. Nata City. Nata City? Yes. I want to go to Iquitos. Whoa. <laughs> so slippery here. Oh man. He's saying to go with him 80. Paradero. For two people? Yeah. Okay. 15 yeah. para dos. Sí. Para dos. Vamos. With no mood to negotiate, I'm exhausted. So let's get in this, uh, I think it's a rickshaw. There is a rickshaw in this bloody thing for an hour. Right, 
Right, so that rickshaw's dropped us off to the bus station. And now we're going to get a joint shared minibus to Iquitos. I'm guessing on one of these. Iquitos? Iquitos? Si. Si. How, how much? No, no. Tiene boleta Iquitos? Ah, creo que si. Iquitos? Ah, si. Si. Wow, I am completely shagged. 30 hours on that ferry, two and a half hours just sent on that bloody bus. I am exhausted, but we have finally arrived here in the city of Iquitos, so I'm buzzing. So I just want to relax, chill out for the evening and get my cock out. Cock brand mosquito repellent so um, yeah thanks for watching guys that is the brutality of traveling Peru let me know if you can handle that trip yourself and yeah see you guys in the next video here in Peru man wow